We have to be quiet. Yeah, this is Sister Wives Season 7, Episode 3. So first of all, we're back. And we have to apologize for missing a bunch of episodes because we had a baby. This is him. Well, I had a baby. You did? <laughs> John did all the hard work. Yeah. So, um... So not only that, but we managed to miss the first two episodes, and I'm not even sure. So we're trying to catch up. Our DVR's gone kaput, and so we had to replace it. So we have to watch all the episodes like in the next two days and recap them so that we can send the old DVR back. So anyway, we're starting with episode three. He pops the question. I don't know how we missed the first two episodes, but we did. Sorry about that. I guess we'll try to come back to him later. Um, so first of all, my first note is that I don't remember any of this stuff. I don't remember Tony asking for her hand in marriage. I don't remember, um, Co we miss Cody talking to Mariah about her anger. So, uh, sorry about that. Um, so McKelty, uh, uh, Cody's like really entranced. I don't know what his deal is with all of these like boyfriends. Cause he's like, Tony's just so, he used the word entrancing. What did he use? persuasive and smooth and I was like that kid like he seems like a nice kid but he seems like a kid like I don't see him as being this powerhouse of negotiation like Cody said but he does remind me a little bit of Cody in a little ways like he's kind of a little I don't know what do you think you watched the episode right it was awful I can't believe they passed that off as entertainment it was it was pretty brutal okay there you go. So Madison has her wedding, and just watching her talk to the family makes me anxious. Like I can feel the anxiety crawling up my throat because it's like her big day, and she's got to orchestrate all these people, and they are supposed to be adults. And she's like, "Please don't be late. I've made all of the arrangements. All I have to do is show up." And they're still like, "Wow, I have to get ready that early in the day." And I'm like, "Have you never been to a wedding? Like you, you know?" And then and then she's like, "I got I got rooms for everyone. If the boys want to camp, they can." And then they were like, well, is there enough room? Is there enough room? Is there enough room? And I thought, and if there's not, can't you just suffer for 24 hours? Can't you get a, you know what I mean? Like, this isn't, she's getting married. Maybe you could, I don't know, not be a huge pain in the butt about the whole thing. So there's that. And the whole thing is McKelty going on this hike. Um, and I guess they already got the ring. And they got engaged. And I, you know, this is my thing on it. Like, I think she's super young, but I got married at 30. So I kind of feel like I can say that. But she's been raised in a family where all of the mothers, not all the mothers, but most of the mothers got married really young. Like, and they didn't go to college and stuff like that. So I kind of feel like it's a little hypocritical of her parents to be like, oh, you're so young. And it's like, well, yeah, but so are you. Like, if my kid wants to get married at 19, I can be like, no. You need to discover yourself because we were Whatever old. gets him out of the house. John, not my baby. Yeah. No. <laughs> no, my little friend. Stop it. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. <laughs> um, <laughs> anyway, and then Janelle and Mary went to counseling. And gosh, it's just, it's one of those things where, like John said, like you go, if I pitched you a show that was like, I, oh, like okay, well, one of the characters is going to go on a hike for the entire episode and they get engaged at the end. And another one's going to talk about their counseling and things that happened 20 years ago. And then we're going to talk about a wedding. Like, you would be like, oh, wow, sign me up for that show. Woo, that sounds amazing. So interesting. Anyway, do you have anything to add, John? We don't have a show. I know. We really should, though. Okay. Well, then that's it. We'll see you in a bit.